everybody. I just want to do a quick Dollar Tree haul. I ran in Dollar Tree today to pick up a few things. Actually, I just went in there to see what they had. And you know how that goes. Um, I picked up things that I don't normally pick up. Like, I normally just stay around the cosmetics. But I, I'll just show you real quick what I got. I got the Spick and Span Everyday Antibacterial Spray Cleaner Disinfectant. And it's fresh citrus scent. Fresh citrus scent. And I got the Spick and Span wet wipes, all purpose wet wipes. I plan to put these in the bathroom. Okay. I bought this is a water repellent jumbo utility bag. I don't know what the quality of it is. Let me go ahead and open it now. It's probably real thin and cheap. But I bought it to put some clothes in. Oh, it's not bad. Actually, it's not. It's uh, not bad. I like it. I like it. I'm going to use this for storing clothes in. So, I'm impressed, actually. Better than I thought it was. So, if you see this... This water repellent jumbo utility bag, and you need to store something. It says drawstring closure keeps items secure. Great for storing and carrying laundry, camping gear, and more. But so here's the drawstring, and there you go. Awesome. Okay. And the next thing I got is some incense sticks. This is a must musk scented and I I must say I really do like the smell of these this is like um, St. Jude religious type um, things on the on the packaging that I'm not I think it's Catholic stuff I'm not really sure but I didn't buy it for that I bought it because it really smells good and I'm gonna be burning this later on and I bought the incense stick holder to go with it and I bought a satin satin bonnet okay. and two scented oil refills and I have some of the uh, I guess they renews it so I'm not really sure which one I have that and this is supposed to fit in with it so I'm hoping so. So I got two in the Ocean Mist fragrance, and I really, really, really like it. It smells good. I can't wait to put it in. I'll let you know how it is once I plug it in. And the final thing I got was from the Frozen Food section, and it was Luigi Sherbet Orange. Um, orange Sherbet. And it was very good. Um, not quite on my plan, but it was three and a half servings in this little bitty thing. Each serving was 90 calories, and of course I ate all, all of it. And, um, it was, so that's what, 270 plus one, ooh, almost 400 calories, wow. But it was very good. You know, I said I'm gonna go to training tomorrow, and... I said all April I'm going to be on the straight and narrow. I'm going to the grocery store tomorrow. And I'm back on my fruit and vegetables. And I may uh, put some tuna here and there in that plan. But I'm going to try and stay with fruits and vegetables as much as possible. And the trainer told me to do um, almonds and pistachio, pistachios. And I forgot. I Oh, no, no. I didn't get it from there scratch what I was getting ready to say. That's another haul. But, um, yeah, that's it. And I think that's all I want to say about the Dollar Tree. Yep, that's all I got. So I hope you enjoyed it. And I'm going to be showing you footage of, of the makeup aisle and the grocery, I mean the freezer section. And I was very impressed with the freezer section. I didn't know they had name brands and eggs and blue bonnet and just I didn't know they had all that stuff in there and actually you'll see in the footage where I picked up some spinach some frozen spinach 
And I actually took it to the register, and when I got to the register, I realized that it was split. So be very careful when you buy frozen frozen um, foods like that in the in the plastic bags. I, I've had it happen many times when I've gotten home, and it's like splits in the bag. And I'm very nervous about eating stuff that has that in there, on there. So I just be very careful and look at it before you get home. I'm glad I saw it, but the only reason why I noticed, noticed it is because it started leaking. So anyway, thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.